Over the past few months, I've played an excessive amount of Five Nights at Freddy's fan games, and one of the main things I've learned uh, that is... <laughs> Five Nights at Candy's one. Very, very easy game. It may have been the easiest game I've, ne I've ever played. What? I'm go I'm going into this thinking you already know what the fuck to do. No, I'm not. Why would I do that? That's not what I'm doing. Why would I do that? Why did I say that? That's not what I'm doing. <laughs> the strategy I needed to use. And then you hear the footsteps. They walk away. Clo <laughs> Welcome to getting over it. Now, if anybody... No, uh, n nobody would. <laughs> all the way to night six and he's pretty easy to deal with everybody knows this uh well, not everybody knows this buddy boy it stays the same length of broken time time broken same length of broken what the fuck is happening bro how's it going that is not how i start shit i it could be i could try it i've got a pope inside my bum am i eight years old no so why is he in there Man, what am I doing? Today, we are reacting to the... Uh, <sighs> During the game, you have a, re uh, a cassette player, not a record player. I kept calling it a record player. It's not a record player. I'm not like, you know, I'm still Gen Z. I don't... I can't d differentiate. 